Welcome, food enthusiasts, to a culinary journey like no other. Today we are diving deep into the vibrant and diverse world of African street food. Get ready to tantalize your taste buds as you explore the unique flavors, aromas, and traditions that make African street food an unforgettable experience. So buckle up and let the feast begin. Uh, you have to be clean first. Yeah, before you eat. Yeah. After a few minutes of waiting, finally our Somali food is ready. So, uh, like I can see, like uh, you have uh, brought uh, like lots of different uh, Somali food. So I'd love you to explain to the audience like uh, the names. Of this Somali food, yes. yeah. So, what are the names? This is called spaghetti plain. Spaghetti plain. This is sukar, camel meat. Okay. This is white rice. White rice, yeah. This is the sauce of uh, spaghetti. Sauce of spaghetti. Okay. Yeah. This is mandi. Mandi. Mandi rice, yeah. Mandi rice. Yeah. This is the meat of mandi day local. Okay. All this right. is greens. Greens. Yeah. And what about this one? Like I can see, like bananas and. Yeah, uh, bananas and salad and lemon. Okay. Uh, so let us have a bite. I am going to tell you guys how it is. Very, very delicious. You may try one of these many days. Yeah. You may try to eat that kind of food. You will be salivating. Mm. Yeah. Not delicious. My brother, like I, I'm in, I'm in love with uh, Somali food. You are welcome. Now Somali food is paid. You are welcome. <laughs> yeah. You are welcome. Thank you so much, man. Like, I, like it's so delicious. Like I can, I can feel the spices and the, and the taste, man. Like it's so unique. Like I, like I don't know, I don't have the right words to explain, but I'm really enjoying it. Some chicken here, man. Like look at this. Chicken. Let me just show you how it tastes, like how the chicken looks like. Like it's so fatty, man. Like this is chicken right here. Yeah. So she's putting the camel milk in the glasses as you can see. This is camel milk right here. Camel milk right here. Camel milk. Okay, let's see. We don't do, but we try today. Yeah. Just to the audience out there watching. Wow. Where can you see? You guys like uh, this summer, like it tastes very different and unique, man. Like it's, it doesn't taste just like the cow milk or the goat milk. Like this milk is so different, man. That's all. Like, it's more healthy. Uh, that's why I see like Somalians. Somalians are, are so healthy. Uh, the women are so beautiful because of this. Uh, uh, this delicious uh, camel milk. Uh, Bahalia again. You can see. How, is the, how is the milk? So sweet. So very sweet. Yeah, but it is lighter than. Ah. This one is lighter than the, the one of Mbusi. Okay. The one of Ngombe. Ah. Yeah. You have to differentiate that. Yeah, man. So right now I'm waiting for my chicken. You know, quarter. It's only 200 Kenya shillings. That is like uh, two dollars, as you can see here. Yeah. Yeah, so guys, I can see like my chicken is, uh, you know, it's ready. You can see they added some, I don't know, this is tomato sauce. Also, you know, some mayonnaise there. I thought like the chicken looks fresh man, like, you can see like it looks juicy and fresh, you know, so I can't wait to have my first bite. So that's it, like I'm taking, this is my chicken right here, you know, I'm taking it and putting it on the, you know, on the sauce. You know, so let me have my first bite and tell you guys how it tastes like. Mm. I mean, 
it's so hot and very very delicious man. you can also feel all the spices in the chicken So like I see, I see that they have added some, you know, some salt right here, you know, some salt here. As you can see, I don't know if you guys can see clearly, but but they have added some salt, you know. So if you feel like you know it's not that salty, you can add salt by yourself. You know, guys, like it's all about supporting local businessmen and women you know as, as you can see like customers are flocking here you know like so many people are coming here to buy the chicken because this is the best place to buy your fresh chicken personally i've really really enjoyed the chicken it was so delicious so fresh you know the spices are on point like everything was just on point man. Man, like this is an outdoor kitchen man outdoor kitchen and i'm really loving it you guys can see like my food is being prepared right here this is called matumbo <laughs> now uh, he's adding some salt You guys like Kenyans love chapati man. First bite. Uh -huh. <laughs> How is it? Mm. Amazing. Amazing. Like it's it's uh, it is straight from the pan, straight from the pan. It's so hot, it's so sweet. I can't even explain. I mean, this is the best food you can get, ever get. Mm? <laughs> I can see like uh, you and I we are eating two different foods man. Mm -hmm. Like what are you eating? I'm eating dengue. I don't know how they're called. Green green grams. Green grams? No, no, no. <laughs> <laughs> uh, <laughs> tell us what dengue means in English in the I comments down below. I Maybe I Google. I can Google and tell you guys. But I'm eating dengue. Mm -hmm. Very delicious. It's hot. I mean, hmm. It's amazing. <laughs> And for me, right, uh, right I'm eating uh, some matumbo. So you can tell us what matumbo means in English. Okay? <laughs> okay well, do you, do you even don't know matumbo? I also you're don't know. Me, you're forcing me to, uh -huh. to tell people what I'm eating. So let me have my first bite, man, of the chapati fasts. Mm. Nice. Uh, delicioso. Mm. <laughs> The food is amazing, you know. Mm -hmm. Kenyaji food. Hmm? Mm. You can't miss. When you come here the first time, you'll come here every day, every day. But then it's our second time. And so guys, the, this place is located around uh, opposite Safaricom buildings. As you can see those two buildings right there, those are two Safaricom buildings right here in uh, Westlands. You guys, like you can see like this Matumo right here, like it's so soft, man. I can, I can feel all the all the juices like has cooked it so well man very very professional like I, i'm really loving it it's adding some soy sauce right there as you can see that's the chinese soy sauce mm. so you should definitely come to this area right here uh, and uh, and eat also remember like it's all about supporting local businessmen and women man. so if you come here like it it will be so amazing and and i know that you're gonna love it i like I've, I've really enjoyed the food it was it has been so delicious and amazing man thank you so much thank you a lot come on girl yeah, so i would i would really love to encourage each and every one of you watching this video to make sure to come here and support local business
Thank you so much for watching. Stay tuned for more mouth-watering content as we continue to explore the wild-rich taste of flavors. Share your favorite African street food experience in the comments down below. Subscribe, like, and comment in the comment. <laughs> Subscribe, like, and share the video. Until next time. Yeah, you have to be clean first. Yeah. Before you eat. Yeah. Motor, 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 motor.